Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, Tech the Fiber TF40, their control line of rackets, dare to say their players' lines of rackets, in the 18 by 20. This is the new rendition of that racket. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so the latest edition of the TF40 by Technofiber, this is the 305, 18 by 20. We've tried this before about close to two years ago. Um, we've liked it. We've liked it as one of the better 18 by 20s out there, uh, especially in that 305 uh, weight range. So just to show you the newest paint job, that this racket got. I actually do like the graphics. It's got the new RS sharp section. And it has foam in here for better feel, better control, better reaction. So, but we liked this back in the day. I mean, it's an 1820. And we, we actually like that. And we like Tech the Fibers for making 1820s. So, um, 340. It's got that box beam, as I've mentioned before. And we, you know, we like that as we grew up with that in a lot of the rackets that we played with. So, 18 by 20 pattern, 11.4. This is all strung. 11.4 strung. 323 on the grams. Balance is 1312, which is three points headlight. 328 on the swing weight. I'm loving that number, nice and high. That is actually pretty good. I should could probably play with this with this number as it's just going to give me enough power. 22 on the beams all across means control. Box beam design, as I've showed you before in the past. Rackets made for the serious player. All right. I'm not that serious player, but let's see if I like it. And maybe I can find a serious player to hit with me. All right. I'll see you on the court. On the court, got a TF40 305 from Technofiber. Coach Goo is trying to do his best impression of Coach Chris right it's now. It's really hard to. I don't know how he does it. No, he just kind of. <laughs> All right. Let's hit All right, Tech the Fiber TF40 305 1820. Coach Chris is in Mexico. Got Coach Goo here. What'd you think, Coach Goo? For 1820 racket, it actually felt pretty easy to play with. Usually, 1820 rackets definitely feel a lot more dense, like, it just feels dense in general. So, therefore, it's really hard to create spin. But with this one, um, I was super shocked that it, even though it has the head weight um, feels great, great distribution of the weight around, great feel. It actually created quite a bit of spin. Usually 1820s are pretty hard to create spin with. This 1820 actually, it was actually easy to create spin. So I was really genuinely shocked. Technofiber did a great job with this line for sure, the TF40 series. They did a really great job. Super shocked about it. And yeah, I mean, this Technofiber, you're definitely in the market for sure. Dare I say, 1820 racket of the year. It's definitely top, definitely up there for sure. When you hit the ball on the string, 
you actually can feel the strings move. This has a 64 uh, flex. The, it feels higher than that, though. It feels like yeah. much more powerful than that. It actually was flexing crazy amount, which is interesting. What well, people said. 64 is kind of on the low side, so it's it was producing more power than I would thought on a 64, though. That is true. That is very true. So it was easy to shape. I mean, you could shape anything you want. But, but no, like for it, I usually, I play with the 1820 of the, was it version 7 of the blade? And I couldn't shape anything. This one I could shape without any worries, honestly. So the flex is on the right spots around this frame. It is. Easy to control the flex, easy to control the power. If you're any type of a player, like I'm talking, you know, high intermediate, advanced, pro level player this would definitely be one that you guys should consider it produces a great amount of control feedback and just enough power for anybody out there to you know put it over the net or to put it away so um easily comes through the air easily uh, 1820 as coach Gu was saying doesn't feel like it it really definitely does doesn't like feel it. like it. There's a great amount of snapback. I think they spaced out the strings very well because mm -hmm. those they don't did. look super tiny. They don't look super tiny. They actually look pretty close to a 1619 from far away if you look at it. That's correct. But Unlike uh, Strike in the Strike is really oh. yeah. This That's is night and day. This one's actually this is hard to see. Perfectly spaced. Mm -hmm. So if you guys are in the market for an 1820, if you're a string breaker of any type. Definitely give this one a shot. All right, great playing stick. I want to thank my man, Coach Goo. Coach Goo, where can we find you? You can find me at agu.tennis. I'll also be posting content there as well. All right, possibly 1820 racket of the year, TF40, 305. Definitely contender. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.